Welcome everyone. So today we are going to understand why the answer for this question is not supposed to be just 3. See we have x square minus 9 equals to 0. So just put the 9 on the other side. How we can do that? By adding 9 on both sides. So you have x square minus 9 plus 9 becomes 0. So you just write x square on your LHS and here you have 0 plus 9 which is 9. But whenever you have a variable okay which is at least in terms of squares or in terms of any even powers. In order to find the value of x, here in this case, we'll take a root. Now, whenever you take a root, okay, in this case, especially if the number is equal to, even if it is a positive number, it is equal to what? Uh, a variable. In that case, the answer will always have a plus minus situation. So, answer for x in this case is supposed to be plus minus 3. Let's put it over here. See, for 3 square minus 9, obviously that is basically 9 minus 9. That is getting you 0. What happens when you do a minus 3 square? Square of a negative number is always positive. So, 9 minus 9 again gets you 0. So, we can say value of x in this particular question is supposed to be plus minus 3. I hope this is very, very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.